Casey, you need some margarine? I might. So how's work going? Oh, I'm still super frustrated. Why? I just feel like there's a double standard for men and women. Like, the guys can be out in the hallway talking as loud as they want, and nobody bats an eye, and I go out to the water cooler to talk to Audrey for five minutes, and people slam the door like it's too loud. It just seems like men and women are held to different standards. Well, unfortunately, yeah. I mean, I don't know. I might say something, but Hello. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. Okay, what else is in this recipe here? Oh, did we add salt? No. Maybe we should do that. A pinch of salt. Pinch of salt. Um. So anyway, the reason I'm saying all that is because um, I need eggs. Um, I'm making oh. a recipe, and if you have two eggs, okay. I can yeah, come on in. Come on in. Oh, yeah, we do. Thank We're so cooking. Nice. We have eggs for sure today. Yeah, I'm, I'm Lacey. Nice to meet you. That's Hi. my mom. Oh. Lacey's mom, Hi. Cookie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Have a seat. I'll check if we have eggs. Thank you. Do you have nice. any eggs? We though? do. We because we're making this. I I made sure we had some. Okay. Oh yeah. Yeah. There's, there's extra in there too. We got extras for this. So. Okay. Here's some eggs. Oh, thank you so much. Good luck with everything. All right. Yeah. Welcome to the neighborhood. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Nice to meet you. Yeah. You guys have a great night. You too. Maybe we can have you over for a game night or something. I love that. Okay. All right. Yeah. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Bye. I'm really glad you came over to help me with this garden today. It's overwhelming, and you're a much better gardener than me. So I'm going to follow you. Your crop your mints looking great though. Yeah, it's you think? Great. Oh, good. I can't wait to make tea out of it. That'll be nice. Yeah. Hey, um, remember I told you that I went to that township dinner last week yeah. with Gabe? It was, it was fun, but it still just brings back that sore topic of how men and women are treated differently in this society. But that's fun, I guess. <laughs> I know it always comes up, but I keep finding more examples. <laughs> well, like, so one of his friends was like, oh, are you a stay-at-home mom? And I'm like, is that really your first question that you're going to assume? Why would you assume that? Why would you assume that? I, that's what I want to know. Like, ask me what I do. I'm not going to assume you're a stay-at-home dad. No, but Devin would have announced it. I know. She's walking around. I know. He'd make everybody know. Yeah, that's what gets me so pissed off. I can't, don't get me on my, don't get me on my soapbox. Let's just focus on the garden. Um, what else do I need to do with the mint? I think the mint's good. Okay. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah
my gosh. Oh, yeah. Do you remember that neighbor that came over yesterday? Yeah, well, he's not as nice as he seems to be. He never picked up his chicken. No, I've had it all night. I just woke up. I have it locked in the garage because I couldn't stand the clucking and the pecking and the chicken poop everywhere. Yeah, I don't know what's up. And he never contacted me. Right, he broke literally every unspoken rule in the neighborhood book. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I'm, I'm literally, I think I'm just going to go take it to his house. Like, if he's not there, maybe I'll just leave it on the front porch. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting dressed and I'm going to take the chicken back to his house right now. Yeah, I've had enough of this. All right, talk to you later, Alyssa. Them. Her name is Mavis. <laughs> I might have to text you for the spelling yeah. of that. <laughs>